In this video, you will see simple steps that will help you write any type of essay successfully. Just like any other academic paper, essays require going through several stages of writing process. This way, you'll manage to handle this task quickly and easily meeting all requirements to your essay. To complete your writing task successfully, you will need to go through several easy steps. Determine type of essay and topic to find out what format and structure you'll need to follow. Some of the most common include narrative, expository, argumentative, persuasive, comparative, and literary. Are you presenting an overview or telling a story about the topic, narrative, or are you providing an analysis, expository? Do you have to convince the reader to adopt a certain point of view or to take a particular action, persuasive? Are you writing an essay about a book you read? Literary? Determining the type of essay is the first step to writing a targeted essay. Even though their structure is pretty much the same, all essays are still different in many respects depending on what topic you're writing about, what type of essay it is and other factors. Taking into account all of these factors is therefore the first step to writing the whole paper successfully. Brainstorm the ideas to make sure you find the relevant answer to the main points of your essay. To achieve this goal, write down ideas coming up in your mind. Jot down quotations and take notes to prove some arguments. Brainstorming always helps in finding additional details to be mentioned in your paper. Gather materials to get ready for research. After you get a particular topic to write about, don't forget to find reliable sources for future research. It's better to find sources and gather the material for your paper from trusted internet resources. Don't forget to include them all into the list of references after you finish writing your essay. One of the key steps to writing any essay or any other type of paper is to get a better idea on the main point of what you're going to write about. In fact, you can still get a poor grade for your essay if it doesn't cover the main idea behind your paper. To handle this task, be sure to consider the next points including Essay Topic Length of your essay Research needed for full understanding of essay topic The way of how essay topic is related to what was covered in class Anything else that you may need for successful completion of task Once you cover these points, you'll be ready to go on with your essay writing Present the thesis statement. In basic terms, thesis is an important part of essay writing as it gives audience a better idea on the central point of your essay. A clearly written thesis is essential for every well-written essay. Therefore, it's best to write it as clearly and comprehensively as possible so that you can go back to it throughout the writing process. To create a great thesis, ask yourself what you want to argue about in your essay. Key arguments you come up with can become the main points addressed in your writing. To do everything correctly, it's better to think over the main ideas related to your topic along with key arguments in support of your viewpoint. Just keep in mind that theses can make the whole difference between an A plus and a lower grade. Make an outline. Based on your thesis. Think of key ideas you wish to include in your writing. Develop an outline before you continue writing your paper. Based on the ideas covered in your thesis statement, think of what you need to include in your essay and what points you want to cover throughout your writing. This will help you write the draft of your essay quicker and easier. Write an introduction to your essay. Introduction covers the main idea of essay paper. It includes thesis statement, facts, Quotes and examples or any interesting information to capture reader's attention. The introduction to an essay of any type is where author discusses the key idea of what the paper itself is all about. This part of your paper sets the tone and should include thesis statement, factual data and some interesting facts to draw reader's attention. To achieve this, it's best to start the introductory part of your paper with some examples or quotes. Write the body of the essay. The body part itself usually gives detailed information in support of your thesis. The best way to write it correctly is to use the key points summarized in your outline and explain all of them one by one. 
You should also support your ideas with evidence like facts, statistics, and examples. Provide key ideas or arguments, prove them with factual data, statistics and examples, and use linking words like nevertheless, in addition, and moreover as a way to link key points throughout your writing. Besides, it's worth using these words at the beginning of every paragraph. This will help your readers to link the previously written information with what is written next. One more tip that you may find useful is not to start your essay with introductory paragraph as this is where students usually face problems. By starting your essay with body part, you'll manage to shape main arguments and ideas beforehand so as come back to them later. Use reliable sources as references. Reliable sources for writing any essay include academic journals, articles, books and textbooks or anything found on Google Scholar. The use of quotations and contextual data from trusted sources is also important as it helps to make the essay content credible and support key arguments stated in your writing. This is only possible to achieve if you use trusted academic resources like journals, articles, books, and textbooks. Come up with conclusion. Restate your thesis, sum up main ideas of your essay, and review what you wrote without adding anything new. Conclusion should always start with stating your thesis once again. This is where you need to sum up the main ideas of your paper and address key arguments contained in the body part as the best way to prove your thesis. Basically, conclusion is a summary of your essay content where you briefly review what you've written before. The ending of this part should also be intriguing and compelling. Just try not to add anything new when writing conclusion. Proofread and edit your essay content. Check if essay content meets teacher's instructions and cut out any unnecessary information. Try to give answers to all points in your essay so as to meet your teacher's directions. To make everything correctly, don't forget that every sentence can make the whole difference. If something is absolutely unnecessary, just cut it out from your paper. In fact, most college and university instructors would rather get a properly written paper that doesn't meet some format requirements but is entirely up to the point. Reviewing is also an important part of writing essays. Most teachers don't even finish reading students' papers if they contain any grammar or spelling mistakes. Here are a few useful tips that can help you make the essay error-free and grammatically correct. Print out the essay and read it through to find mistakes. Ask your family or friends to read the essay and understand what you've missed. Read the paper aloud yourself to get a better idea of what is wrong in it. To make everything done, it's worth reading the text once more and fixing any additional imperfections you find like punctuation mistakes or any grammatical errors as well as the style of writing itself. This way, you'll make the whole paper error-free to meet all requirements. Make sure you achieve good readability of your essay and ensure that nothing is missing in your paper. When writing any type of essay, it is also important to add footnotes in the list of references. As an extra tip, Try to improve your essay quality by making it as understandable and comprehensive as possible. In fact, for most students' essays and other academic papers can be a real challenge even if they have the necessary skills. That's why it's always better to improve your writing with each and every task you complete. If you like the video please like and subscribe.